with the Monday Morning Pep Rally. Hey, this is Kylie Fitz. You're watching HS Game Time with Pep Fernandez. Kylie Fitz, where will he end up? I'm Pep Fernandez, and this is the Monday Morning Pep Rally. The Redlands East Valley football star is still looking at schools. I caught up with Fitz prior to his visit to Notre Dame this past weekend. He said he still plans to meet with Utah as well before making his decision live on ESPN on February 6th. Hey, Kylie, forget about ESPN. Make your pick right here on the Monday Morning Pep Rally. Oh, yeah. The Polly Bears will have a new head football coach next season. Venus Brown will make the move from North to Polly. Yeah, it's going to be a little bit different. You know, I've been at North High School for 16 years now, and uh, to go uh, to Polly, I'm really excited for the opportunity. Bears. Girls soccer coach Jamie Brewer recorded her 100th career win as the Polly head coach. The secret to her success might be this lady, Grandma Pam. She gives the players treats and they're delicious. Maybe sweets are the key to winning games. I do look back and I laugh. I'm like, oh my God, it seems so short but so long. And then I look at my kids. My oldest kid is um, eight, nine. She turns nine next week. And she started when she was um, six months old. So it's like, oh my gosh, where's the time going? Santiago is ready to sock it to you and the rest of the Big 8 League. The Sharks girls basketball team has won 73 straight league games and the beat goes on. Santiago has Roosevelt and Corona this week. Now to the boys, Centennial is running away with the Big 8, but Roosevelt has staked claim to second place in the league standings. The Mustangs are coming off an overtime win versus King, as Roosevelt is undefeated at home this season. We just knew we had to win this. We haven't lost at home yet this year, and we got to keep our fans coming back and stuff like that. The big game on the boys' side this week is North versus the Rancho Verde on Friday. The Mustangs won the first matchup between these two hoop heavyweights, 55 to 52. North needs to win to stay in the hunt for the Inland Valley title. After beating defending Sun Belt champ Temesco Canyon last week, Paloma Valley is on the verge of clinching a wrestling league title. These Matt Cats will take on Lakeside this week and will look to capture the school's third league championship in wrestling. And another big time match on the mat will be Santiago taking on Centennial in Big 8 action. I'm Pep Fernandez and this is the Monday Morning Pep Rally.